This is a question from data structures. The number of rotations required to insert a sequence of elements 9, 6, 5, 8, 7, 10 into an empty avial tree is. So first of all, avial tree is a height balanced binary search tree. The balancing factor in avial tree should be either minus 1, 0 or plus 1 and the balancing factor is calculated as height of left subtree. minus height of right subtree. So the balancing factor for a particular node is this. So if the balancing factor is not among these three values, then the balancing factor is violated. Then we have to perform either the following rotations LL that is left left, LR, RL and RR. We have to perform any one of these rotation to again balance it. Now based on this information, let's try to draw it. So First is 9. Now the balancing factor of this is 0 because there is no left or right subtree. Now we insert 6. Now the balancing factor of this node becomes 1 that is this height minus 0 that is this height. So we have left subtree as height 1 and right subtree as height 0. So the balancing factor is plus 1. We write it as 1. This has balancing factor 0 because it has no left or right nodes. Now we insert 5. Upon inserting 5, the balance factor all gets changed. Now it becomes this. It will be 2 for this. This will be plus 1 and this will be 0. Now the balance factor got changed. This got changed because of inserting left left. We have to perform this rotation because it is inserted in the left node of the left. Now, upon performing LL rotation, we lift 6 up. We move 5 to the left and 9 to the right. Now, this has a balance factor of 0. This also has a balance factor 0. This also has a balance factor 0. Now, we are inserting 8. When we are inserting 8, we insert it here. Now, the balance factor changes for this node. That is 1 minus 2. That is 1 will be here and 2 will be this. So, this has minus 1 as the balance factor. This will have 1 as the balance factor and this has balance factor 0. Now we are inserting 7. Upon inserting 7, what happens is 7 gets inserted here. Now this is also violating the balance condition because this is 1 minus 3. So the balancing factor becomes minus 2. Here the balancing factor becomes 2 because 2 minus this has no left uh, right subtree. So the balancing factor of this node gets disturbed due to insertion of LL. So again we perform the rotation. That is we lift this node 8 up. So 8 will be lifted up. Then we have 7. We have 9 here. Then 6 will be here. And we have 5 here. Now the balancing factor of 6 is 1 minus 2. That is minus 1. This has 0. This also has 0, this also has 0, this also has 0. Now we are inserting 10 into this. Upon inserting 10, what happens is the balance factor becomes 1 minus 3, that is minus 2. The balance factor here becomes 1 minus 2, that is minus 1. The balance factor here it becomes 0 minus 1, so that is minus 1. Here it is 0. So now what happens here is we have RR imbalance here. So we rotate it again and we get the three aspects. We have 8 here, we have 6 here, we have 5 here, we have 7 here, we have 9 and 10 here. So in total, we have made three rotations LL, LL followed by RR. So three rotations we have made. So the number of rotations required to insert this sequence is option D. 